Hi everyone. Uh, I wanted to uh, speak about this uh, three important things which are repeatedly being asked in my channel. So uh, I just uh, thought that uh, sharing these details will uh, really uh, going to be useful for you. So let's quickly start. Actually, the first one is about whether taking piping design as a career is it good for a long term or not. I know these uh, kind of thoughts are generally uh, comes up when you are looking for more uh, secured profession actually. So for those who are coming out with such questions actually, let, let, let me ask you, do you uh, can you name one field where you can feel more uh, secured other than government jobs? Because I understand government jobs are more secured, but you do not know the level of competence required in government jobs because the kind of examination and the kind of aptitude skills and the mathematical and the answering skills which are required is too high like uh, for an average candidate to get qualified in government jobs it takes nearly five to six years of preparation actually you can check with anyone who is trying for a government jobs and moreover and uh, getting into a government jobs uh, it gives you uh, secured a uh, feeling but when compared to the flexibility with private companies switching over a job so there are some constraints i'm not saying it is uh, completely not okay to have uh, government jobs but according to me i'm saying actually so again back to our question so you have to list down the one field which is other than government jobs where you can feel more secure most of us tells uh, to uh, choose uh, it see let me tell you very clearly go and speak to it uh, professions actually it is an ever dynamic and ever changing field you have to have that attitude of uh, improving skills in day by day, time to time and uh, the, at every stage of your uh, career actually. But it's uh, compared to other fields, it's not uh, so like an IT field, you have to keep on updating. Yes, definitely you have to keep on updating, but it is not so dynamic like an IT sector. And moreover, in IT sector, the, um, uh, the requirement varies time to time actually. At some uh, point of time, there will be a demand of one particular software and in other point of time there will be demand of other particular software so those who are uh, trained in one particular things uh, will lose their uh, period if they uh, get on to the next level actually so you can find a lot of uh, middle level managers who are trying to uh, find hard time in surviving in it sectors so don't take that comparison so uh, if you logically think that why uh, piping design should be the good career i would name that oil and gas sectors are not going to end because right now this is the only surplus energy available in the world the battery kind of energies and battery kind of engineering are still emerging actually it has uh, just launched into our market it will take a lot of time to um, uh, what do you call replace oil and gas but still i truly feel oil and gas cannot be replaced because that is a surplus energy where nobody wants to um, just uh, what do you call take out from this world actually so piping design career is going to survive for uh, the longer period of time until we have the oil and gas in this world actually and the second important thing is about a lot of people are asking about uh, tell me or suggest me the institute best institute for piping design uh, engineering studies actually see for those who are looking for institute let me tell you uh, my uh, frank opinion is that uh, for me, I truly feel that there are no institutes in uh, right uh, in. Uh, I'm not. Uh, I don't want to uh, criticize that. There are no. Uh, what do you call? Um, uh, I, I'm not sure how to name it because I don't want to get into a trap. Actually, uh, the 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 institutes which can give the proper training, you cannot find such institutes in in our country now. So uh, what you can do is that you have to get uh, the software training from any institutes because software training is the one training that most institutes are giving but not the job oriented training like how to design, how to make a routing, how to provide support, how to um, uh, check the engineering standards and which part of the standards are applicable. So those things nobody actually uh, guides you. So what I would suggest is that the first thing that you have to learn is that software. Learn the uh, the most demanding softwares uh, such as PDS, SP3D and uh, E3D. Those things you learn from any uh, institutes and uh, do a self preparation. Self preparation you can find a lot of my uh, contents useful for you and uh, those who are completely new then uh, I would advise to take some couple of course uh, in from Udemy platform or from any other uh, sites actually and do a self study. Do not 
uh, forget about uh, i mean uh, to do not eliminate the option to read from books books gives a lot of uh, good informations you have to dedicate your hours you have to uh, give some time and keep on uh, improving your knowledge and make sure that you at least uh, learn few new things uh, in uh, daily basis actually so self improvement and self study is one of the key thing and the very important thing you have to do for those who want to learn actually try to learn from the experienced people like me there are a lot of people who gives training that you can i am not only uh, referring my name i am not asking you to come to uh, me uh, for uh, take training on uh, with me and all you can go to n number of people now linkedin is a wonderful platform you can find lot of people even you can find people from your um, what do you call neighboring uh, places or uh, the place or the localities where you are staying actually so those people can give you a true experience so that is the a core learning actually that you will not get from any institutes actually so this is my recommendation for those who wanted to study piping design engineering okay and the uh, third is about uh, how to find a piping opportunities in gulf actually see uh, nowadays uh, the time is not uh, like uh, 10 years ago 10 years ago you have a very limited option to find these jobs but nowadays online portals are a wonderful portals and uh, you find a hell lot of uh, opportunities in this online portals one of the popular portal portal is uh, naukrigulf.com and you can find uh, n number of uh, good quality jobs in naukri and the second one is uh, i would strongly recommend linkedin and the third one is indeed so these are the three portals and there are a lot of other portals and especially one more thing i would like to add is oil and gas uh, job search so this is one of the another website where you can find lot of opportunities actually so uh, the what i'm trying to say is that it's not it's not so hard to uh, uh, find jobs in gulf these days you can even try uh, mentioning the name of the designation in google google will uh, uh, what do you call list out different opportunities which are posted in multiple websites so that will also uh, lead you to uh, good opportunities actually so the process is that you apply through online and you get an interview call once your cv is got shortlisted and then uh, once uh, you got shortlisted through the interview and you will get a visa actually it is uh, so uh, uh, easy nowadays actually not like um, uh, the days which are uh, 10 years or 15 years ago uh, like when i tried uh, 10 years ago and the situation was completely different i have to uh, check the newspaper i have to go to the agencies but nowadays you don't have to go to agencies all job opportunities are in front of you in the online job portals so don't uh, waste your money by uh, giving uh, some uh, bribes to agencies in the name of uh, getting an opportunity in uh, to gulf because gulf is uh, now uh, open to everyone you can find jobs in uh, all this uh, online portals so this is the best way to find uh, gulf uh, opportunities for piping engineers so i guess i answered for these three questions i so i will try to me uh, post you in another video which will be really really useful for you to improve in piping design career until then bye from subhash chandra